Yeah, I'm trying to get in touch with Sharon Leonard. She works for the NYU paper. This is Jerry Seinfeld. She was supposed to meet me at a coffee shop to do an interview. Okay. Those two girls behind you, they're eavesdropping. Really? You know, uh, just because you two are homosexual, so what? <laughs> I mean, you should just come out of the closet and be openly gay already. So what do you say? <laughs> you know you'll always be the only man I'll ever love. What's the matter with you? Yeah, I'm not going along. I just see you in Berlin in 1939, goose-stepping past me. Come on, Jerry, go along, go along. You no fun. You know, I hear that all the time. Hear what? That I'm gay. People think I'm gay. Yeah, you know, people ask me that about you, too. Yeah, because I'm single, I'm thin, and I'm neat. <laughs> and you get along well with women. Guess that leaves me in the clear. <laughs> Hi, Jerry. It's Sharon Leonard from the NYU paper. I'm here at the coffee shop, and I was a little late. I guess we must have missed each other. I'm going to the bathroom. No, oh, I'm cool. I'll be here for a little while longer, and I'll try to hook up with you later. Come on up. Who's that? Oh, that's that uh, reporter from NYU. She's finally going to do the interview. I told her to come up here so this way we wouldn't miss each other. Uh, do you want me to stay? Or... Sure, I don't care. Hi. Hi, I'm, I'm Sharon. Hi, I'm Jerry. Something the matter? No, 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 nothing. You look familiar. Have we ever met? I'm, I'm not sure. Have we? You look familiar. Uh, why don't we do this uh, over here? Oh. This is George. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. He's gonna hang around if that's all right with you. Sure, I'd like to talk to him too. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, okay. There we go. Uh oh. Oh, is that a problem? No, I, I just uh, hate my, my, my voice on tape. It always sounds so high and whiny. <laughs> uh, shall we start? Fire away. Okay, let's see. Um, are you just a comedian, or do you do anything else? Uh, well, right now, George and I are writing a pilot for NBC. Oh, so you also work together? Yeah. <laughs> Jerry, did you wash this pair? Yeah, I washed it. It looks like it hasn't been washed. So wash it. You hear the way he talks to me? You should hear how my boyfriend talks to me. <laughs> what? Hey, uh, let me ask you something. What do you think of this shirt? It's nice. Jerry said he didn't like it. I didn't say I didn't like it. I said it was okay. Oh, you said you didn't like it. Oh, well, so what if I don't like it? Is that like the end of the world or something? So how did you two meet? Oh, actually, we met in the uh, gym locker room. Yeah. Actually, it was in gym class. I, I was trying to climb the ropes, and uh, Jerry was spotting me. <clears throat> and uh, I kept slipping and burning my thighs. And then finally I slipped and I fell on Jerry's head. <laughs> Yeah, we've been close ever since. Do you guys live together? Live together? No, I got, I got my own place. Oh. And do your parents know? Know what? My parents? They don't know what's going on. <laughs> oh, God, you're that girl in the coffee shop that was eavesdropping on us. I knew you looked familiar. Oh, no! Oh. No! There's been a big misunderstanding here. Yeah, yeah. We did that whole thing for your benefit. We knew you were eavesdropping. That's why my friend said all that. It was on purpose. We're not gay. Not that there's anything wrong with that. No, of course not. I mean, it's fine if that's who you are. Absolutely. I mean, I have many gay friends. My father's gay. Look, I... I, I know what I heard. I heard. It was a joke. All right, look, you want to have sex right now? Do you want to have sex with me right now? Let's go. Let's go. I thought we were going to take a steam. <laughs> no, no, I don't no, want to no take steam. steam. No steam. Well, I don't want to sit there naked all by myself. 